After New York Muhammad Ali's death hits particularly hard for the local boxing community, News 4's Marissa Perlman shows us how one boxer hopes to keep his memory alive. The first book I ever bought was Muhammad Ali on the cover. For Don Patterson, besides his parents, there's no person in this world he looks up to more than Muhammad Ali. This man spoke for himself, uh, and he spoke his mind, and he spoke for the oppressed people. Patterson, a former boxer himself, is now a coach at the Northwest Community Center. As a kid, after learning about Ali's story, he asked his dad for a pair of gloves. But it was more than him being the greatest at boxing that led Patterson into the ring. He represented so much more than boxing, his place in the world. You know, Ali, citizen of the world. The first time he met Ali, Patterson was nervous. He says he was afraid he wouldn't be the guy he thought he was. When I got up to him, uh, I hugged him, I embraced him, you know, he embraced me back. He put his fist on my jaw, and it was a moment that I'll never forget. And he was able to meet Ali several times over the years. That time is something Patterson says he'll always be thankful for. You know, a little kid out of Queens, New York, who, um, you know, idolized him. He says he takes lessons from Ali with him every day, particularly teaching boxing to his kids. The biggest lesson he learned from Ali, always give back. He understood that I have something to give and that my, my presence here means something to so many people. Reporting in Buffalo, Marissa Perlman, News 4. You can find this. Harry the